serious take. <laughs> Who did this? Like mystery. Dad made it. Did she buy the thing? <laughs> what? Turn around and hold it up. So, how do I use this thing? You just when you get ready to find the cleats you want, we'll pay for them as your <laughs> introduction into your career. Wow, well, thank you. Good morning, you guys. Well, it is the day before a very big event. Bub is moving out. So, come on if you want to go on this journey. Oh, my, my, my. Where does the time go, you guys? Where does the time go? It seems like just yesterday I was pregnant with that little fella and having him, bringing him home and get it acclimated to another little one in the family. And now here it is, 20 years later, time for him to spread those wings. Ah, oh, and I'm not doing too well. <laughs> I'm not doing too well, but at any rate, I'm gonna go today. He's actually leaving tomorrow, so I'm on my way to town to pick up a few little goodies to send him off with a care package, and I'm gonna take you with me. First stop is Big Lodge, trying to find a few things he might like. I found this little pillow. Look at this, wouldn't that be so cute? To put on his bed at my parents' house. He's gotta have toothpaste. I saw this super cool nifty thing little shoe rack not sure how much room mom is gonna have down there in a the little apartment you guys have seen it they had built it for my grandma before she passed away so I'm gonna get him a little shoe rack for those cleats of course he's gonna need something for all those dirty clothes so here is a large pop-up clothes hamper of some of Bub's favorite sparkling water, the pure ice flavored water. Next stop is Dollar Tree. You know I can't let him leave home without something from Dollar Tree. Look at the adorable little soccer bucket. We can keep some of his smaller stuff in there. I'm gonna try to put all the loose stuff in just one big old basket. All right, just a few little odds and ends from Dollar Tree. Now, heading on over to Walmart to pick up a few things there. guarantee you Bubba will come running out to help because he always does. He is so good about helping get groceries in the house and all that kind of stuff. So I'll be excited to see his face. He had no idea I was getting him anything to take with him. So let's see how it goes. What? What? <laughs> what is this? That's you a care package and it's going to be awfully heavy. So we may have to put oh it back in back. <laughs> what? That's yours too. <laughs> I like the little bit. <laughs> and then you got some other stuff in there too. You got a shoe rack. Oh. Oh. 
shoe rack. What's that little dirty clothes thing hamper? Yes. Oh, but you got to see what else is in that oh, bag. Oh, the little ball pillow? Yes. <laughs> like a soccer ball. That's cool. And the rest of that's food for the house. Yeah. But no, no, no. There should be one more. That bag is yours. This one? Yeah, but it wouldn't fit yeah. into your basket. Some shampoo, soap, yep, deodorant, <laughs> all the stuff. <laughs> <laughs> we can look at it closer That's when we get cool. in. Yeah. <laughs> well, bud, you get all packed up. Getting some of it ready to go. <laughs> Definitely not ready for this. Now it's getting real, you know what I mean? But you're all excited, eh? Mm-hmm. Big things coming. Yep. Ready to get it going. Yep. yep. Are you taking everything, bud? Uh-uh. Not everything. Just the majority of everything I'll need. So I'll at least have something to still look at, right? <laughs> yep. You are going to get to take this new monitor they gave you. Mm-hmm. And your computer, Nana moved you in a little desk, huh? Yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. You'll have a whole little apartment out there. Yeah, it'll be nice. Have everything out there. We're going to take the whole little dresser, eh? Mm-hmm. That's where I got my last set of black and white ones. Yeah, it's a lot of socks. It's a lot of socks. <laughs> all just socks. But you go through a lot of socks playing all the time. Yeah, at least one pair a day, sometimes two. Well, today's the day, you guys. I see more of his stuff. Just packed and ready. Well, got that fresh fade. Yep. Turn let's see it. Nice. Yes. Yep. Gotta send you off looking all snazzy. Yes, sir. <laughs> well, getting ready to move your little dresser out. Yep. Wow. Yeah, it should fit in the back seat laying on that side. I might need to get on the other side and help feed it through, you reckon? Gunner, you gonna be sad? Is Bub leaving? Is Bub leaving? He's gonna miss you, huh, bud? Uh, Need help? Oh, with him. <laughs> well, it's just about time. Yep. Got everything outside? Yeah, for the most part. So, how you feel? Uh, I'm excited. I'm ready to start this new chapter and ready to get working and get joined with the team and ready to start this next part. It's going to be fun, huh? Yep. Might get to play in the U.S. Open Cup. Hopefully. That'll be a pretty big deal. Mm -hmm. Of course, what do you think about all this coronavirus stuff? Who knows? What if y'all have no fans in the stand? <laughs> Who knows? Because <laughs> they're like shutting down sporting events and everything right now. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, at least you'll have the team. Yeah, we'll see. <laughs> so, we all might just be watching online. Your games will be online, right? So, the ones yeah. that you'll get to play, we could always give a link. Mm -hmm. And they can watch it online. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so. All right. Well, let's get the rest of this stuff in the car and get ready to make that drive. Yep. Support group, you know, supporting me along the way really means a lot. And uh, now I'm ready to get down there, ready to get to work, and ready to start the season. What was that for? Instagram. Not too happy, are you, buddy? Well, there it is. Loaded and ready. Got all his stuff in there. Sure is hard to see that. I thought I left this in my car. Load you down with some good food, huh? Yes, sir. <laughs> hey, come here. Hey, give me a phone. Okay. Aww. I'll see you knows. later, pal. <laughs> mm -hmm.
Well, there he goes and the car in front of us we're following him down steve and i are kristen wasn't able to get away because she had a lot of work that she had to do but we're gonna follow him down and drop him off and i tell you what it is hard it is hard i know you know we've had the little words coming back oh he's just going to your mama's and like it shouldn't be a big deal but you guys even if he was just moving across the street it would be a big deal you know what i mean it's hard when they leave home it's a closure of life as you knew it it's starting something new and it's exciting and we're happy for him but it's sad at the same time he'll be down here for about six months which is longer than a semester of college <laughs> a semester of college is about three and then they're home for Christmas break and then they go back so we will get to see him every Sunday at church and we'll get to catch up with him that way and I'm sure FaceTime and all that good stuff but you guys know all of you mamas it's just not the same it's just not the same you know but anyway let me quit this babbling and get him where he needs to be. Home sweet home for the next little while, eh? A little bit, yep. <laughs> well, let's go get it unloaded. So we're going to give you a little tour of where Bub will be staying. Up in there is the actual main house. All of this used to be Mom and Dad's garage. They've closed it in. They have a big pantry here, the uh, laundry area here, and then you come on out and this will be Bub's little apartment. She's told him they can do some things to kind of make it a little more manly while he's here. <laughs> but they had originally built this little apartment place for my grandma. But then my grandma actually passed away before she was ever able to move in. So she, she had seen it being built and the coloring and all that. But it's got his own little bathroom. It's got the toilet. And of course a shower then he's got this whole dressing area where there is a big nice closet his own little sink and that whole area and then of course the bedroom area he's got a big nice queen bed then these little french doors he can actually use as an entrance right to the outside if he wants to mom said they're gonna make that available to him so he doesn't necessarily have to worry about coming in the main entrance if he doesn't want to. Then he'll have his little desk over here where he'll do all of his editing and stuff. Little sofa. So what you think, bud? Good. I'm used to it. <laughs> That's where I stayed during last season for a couple days out of the week, so. Yeah? Yeah. Last season you stayed about three days of the week, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Now, now you'll be here all the time. Yep. <laughs> so not a bad not a bad little pad not a bad little bachelor pad yep not too bad <laughs> don't know how much time i'll actually be in here but <laughs> yeah with training and everything else maybe not a whole yeah, heck of a lot but not. anyway all right let's get all his stuff unloaded and brought inside cute 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 i love the soccer ball pillow nice touch <sighs> <laughs> got his little clothes hamper already set up that actually turned out to be a pretty nice clothes hamper i showed you guys this at big lots you unzip the top but it does have a top that can zip over if you need to transport it like to a laundromat which he won't have to he'll just wash his clothes here but All right, he's fixing to head over to the church. We're gonna head back home, but we're gonna stop first and fill up his car with some gas and get him all situated. One more ride with the Bubster before we leave him. just like that he is starting a new journey if you guys want to keep up with him and what he's doing you can follow him over on his channel i'll have a link for you down below because you're going to have a whole lot more updates from him i'm sure thanks so much for watching remember just like bub you guys were created for purpose so you get out there and be all you can be while he's going to be all he can be